A path descent is the most economical descent. During a path descent, the FMC controls pitch to stay on the path. You possibly have to use thrust or the speed brake to keep the airspeed you want. Usually, to make a path descent, you should also engage LNAV. If you do not engage LNAV, you must be near the LNAV path. Five miles from top of descent, the FMC scratch pad message Reset MCP Altitude shows. Reset the MCP Altitude. The FMC automatically commands a descent when you pass the top of descent point. The descent page shows automatically. The FMC commands idle thrust. The pitch mode stays VNAV path and the FMC controls pitch to stay on the path. The speed restriction line shows the airport speed restriction for your destination. You can put in a different speed and altitude restriction. Green circles on the navigation display map mode show where the deceleration segment starts and stops. When you are near the airport speed restriction altitude, the descent path angle decreases. The FMC commands higher pitch and the airplane slows. As speed decreases below the speed restriction, the FMC commands lower pitch to descend below the airport speed restriction altitude. The FMC commands a speed 10 knots lower than the airport speed restriction. In this example, the airport speed restriction is 250 knots below 10,000 feet. The FMC commands 240 knots. This gives a buffer for small airspeed changes. Information about the next waypoint with an altitude constraint shows here. If there is a waypoint with an altitude constraint, the path will come to the altitude at the waypoint. After the waypoint, a new path is calculated to the next constraint waypoint. When the airplane comes to the next idle thrust path, the FMC commands idle thrust and lower pitch to follow the path. When you are close to the destination airport, the FMC commands flaps up maneuvering speed. Set flaps 1. When you extend flaps, the FMC commands speeds for the flap positions and your weight. If you do an ILS approach, VNAV disconnects at glide slope capture and the MCP speed display opens.